Milford police say this started a few months ago and it started with burglaries and then turned to vandalism. Things like graffiti on the walls here in the school to even broken glass everywhere. What was formerly St. Gabriel Elementary School in Milford is now a nearly empty building. Recently, it's been targeted multiple times. There's not a lot to steal. They, there was a, um, a flat screen TV that was removed from the wall. But lately, there's not a real lot that they can really take, so they've just been, you know, vandalizing property. Police say whoever's doing it has forced their way in from several different places. On the outside, windows and doors have been shattered. Inside, the damage is widespread. Exit signs have been torn down, items have been broken, and in the kitchen, there's even been food and drinks poured all over the floor and walls. By the, the amount of time that they spend in there, it, when, you, when, we, when we go through to bring our investigators in, it seems like they're, uh, they're, not, they're pretty comfortable staying in there because most of the time burglars are, when they're taking items, they're in and out very quickly. While the school has been closed since 2016, the building is still used for small church events from time to time. However, because of COVID, that hasn't happened in a while. Milford Police has stepped up patrols around the area. We have multiple um, units down here uh, around the clock, you know, checking whether it be on a bicycle, patrol cars, detectives. The school is right across from Milford Police's training facility, so police have been using surveillance video from cameras there to try to find whoever has been breaking in. We're pretty sure that they haven't used the vehicle because we haven't seen any of that on the footage, so we're trying to use what we, even what we don't have, as to try to narrow down our scope. Milford Police are asking anyone with information to give them a call. In Milford, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News. Gabby, thank you very much. New at four, a former